Hey, this is the Swedish Guitar Nerd, and today I'm demoing a cheap amp, since, I don't know, well, uh, I usually demo cheap guitars, and I thought I'd do something different. It's this one, uh, the PV Rage 158, and uh, they seem to have discontinued it as well, so now you can probably get it crazy cheap. Okay, it's a solid state amp, so uh, it's not tube based, it's, um, yeah, it's solid state, it's transistors. And uh, we have two channels, a clean and a lead, and they share uh, EQ of low, mid and high. And uh, there's also a separate uh, EQ switch that's that has two sounds and it affects the entire EQ. It's one is called modern and one is called vintage. The modern is uh, more compressed and not it has not so much high end. And the vintage one is not compressed and it's yeah. much more high end and it's I don't know, it feels more l loose as a whole. Um yeah, and the controls for the channels is for the clean, it's simply volume. Since this is a solid state amp, well, that's basically all you need. Uh, if And this is clean all the way up to 10. Something you won't get uh, out of a tube amp, usually. And I'll show the good things about that. And uh, the lead channel has uh, pre-gain, post-gain, uh, basically the input gain and the volume. Uh, it's a 15 watt amp. It has an 8 inch uh, Blue Marvel speaker and uh, yeah, it's an open back combo. Uh, and volume wise, I've actually used this uh, on gigs as uh, my only amp um, and not even uh, mic'd it. So it's rather loud for its 15 watts. And uh, you think that the 8 inch uh, speaker well that won't make the bass be right or strong and they actually to told me to turn down the bass so i don't know you get to choose for yourselves uh we have a cd or mp3 or whatever auxiliary uh, input and for strange reason it's one of those big ones and we have a headphone out again a uh, Big Jack. I don't know why. And yeah, that's it. So uh, I'll uh, give it a go. And um, yeah, I'll first give you some clean sounds. Then I'll uh, and uh, first in a modern position, then in a vintage position. And then I switch to the lead and uh, do the same thing first in a modern position, then in a vintage position and try different degrees of uh, gain so you get to hear it and um, yeah that's it so here we go <laughs> Thank you. 
and if you wonder why the sound is changing even in the middle when uh, I'm trying out the modern or vintage ones, uh, it's because I'm switching pickups. I'm using, uh, first I used the, the bridge humbucker and then the neck single coil pickup on my guitar. Uh, okay, I'll show one of the good things uh, about having a solid state amp. You can actually put uh, like reverbs and delays before it and it would actually sound good. And those usually don't sound that good if you put them in front of a tube amp. So uh, I'll give you an example of that. So first I go uh, with no effect and then I add a reverb. So here we go. Okay, let's go to the lead channel. Okay, and uh, finally I'll uh, give you an example if, because uh, usually you have an, uh, an amp and you put uh, like a distortion or overdrive pedal in front of it. And uh, this is what it would sound like in the modern sec uh, setting and uh, I have the gain at yeah, like three quarters. So first uh, it's without the overdrive pedal and then I add it. So here's what it sounds like. Thank <laughs> you. 
Okay, this has been the Swedish Guitar Nerd demoing a PV Rage 158 amp. Hope you enjoyed it. See you soon.